It is 839. Today is August 23rd, National Ride the Wind Day. It's the anniversary of the first flight powered by humans that won the Kremer Prize in 1977 when the Gossamer Condor flew 11 miles an hour for about a mile and a half in California. Oh. But wait a minute. Maybe the first human-powered flight wasn't 1977. Someone beat the Condor by about a thousand years. In the year 1010, a monk in England known as Eilmer of Melmsbury Ooh, yes. made wings for his hands and feet and then jumped off the Melmsbury oh, no. Abbey Tower. No. Oh, no. I don't know if he actually said yippee, but he actually flew 600 feet. Wow. Before crashing and breaking both his legs. Oh, well, he gave no. him a shot. Never walked again. Jeez. He realized the mistake was not having a winged tail. He planned to try again. All right. But his boss said no. I don't have the video, but I do have this depiction of Eilmer of Malmesbury. There is now a stained glass window at the Abbey as a tribute to the flying monk. Huh. Which is the name of the new pilot I'm pitching next to our CW today, <laughs> The Flying Monk, starring John C. Riley. Oh, yeah, I like that. <laughs> That's a great idea. Uh, now, Riley hasn't officially confirmed, right. but he yeah. does have my voicemail, so I'm just, I'm um, sure. fingers crossed. Anytime. Yeah. All right, sounds good. Boy, you don't want to break your legs in 1010. There's no, no, <laughs> there's, there's right. no real rehab yeah. facilities, yeah. I'm thinking.